And there is new information tonight in the shooting at Morgan State University. A student there was shot on campus Friday near an apartment building, and tonight police say they have charged the shooter. We also spoke to one of the first people to rush to the victim's aid. 11 News reporter Kai Reed joins us live from Northeast Baltimore with that story. Kai. Well, Donna, according to school officials, that suspect is not a student here at Morgan State University. The court documents give a lot of details about what happened in those minutes after the shooting. As police say, the suspect tried to get away unnoticed. I was actually just came out the, um, the gym area and I heard pop, 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 pop. And within seconds, Joshua Forbes realized his friend and football teammate had been shot. Josh is the one seen here in the video without a shirt on. He took it off to try to put pressure on his friend's wounds. Um, wrapped it around, tied it up as tight as I can, uh, tried holding pressure. And I had found out that, you know, there was too much blood coming out and it just wasn't going to stop after that. Tyrell Okoro was rushed to the hospital. Meantime, according to court documents, an officer driving to the scene spotted 20 year old Keith Robertson not far from the shooting. It says Robertson was on Hillen Road running in the middle of oncoming traffic, trying to hold a gun in his jacket pocket. According to investigators, Robertson had 16 baggies of marijuana in his possession. They say he eventually confessed to shooting Okoro. Great person, great hearted. Uh, down to earth, just great friend, great lineman, great athlete. Okoro is a second year student, a freshman on the football team. He's been released from the hospital after being treated for multiple gunshot wounds. On campus, we found officers patrolling on several street corners, and officials say they've been addressing security concerns with students and parents. As for Josh, he now has a terrifying college memory that he wishes he could forget. I mean, at the same time, I had to be strong for him because, you know, he shot. And so I just had to be like, look, yo, just stay with me. You're fine. And now Robertson is charged with first and second degree attempted murder. As far as the school goes, university officials say they're coming up with some new additional plans to address security here on campus. Reporting live in Northeast Baltimore, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News. Kai, thank you.